powerhouse time, Sue. We're going out west, sunny San Diego. Stay classy, San Diego. Jeff Shearing, San Diego real estate pros at Keller Williams Realty in Carmel Valley. He's been in the industry since 1999. Top 1% of Keller Williams agents worldwide. That's a pretty good commendation. Uh, market stats, we'll give you some of them before we get out to him. According to Trulia.com, the average list price, $645,000 in San Diego. The median sales price, $372,000. Converts to an average price per square foot of $287 per square foot. Jeff, how, how would you characterize the market on a scale of 1 to 10 with 10 being very hot. Listen, this market is hot, it's 10, uh, but it is really a tale of two markets. The lower end, what we consider anything under the conforming, super conforming FHA loan limit of 697,500 here in San Diego County, uh, it's moving quickly. Uh, the million dollar plus properties are a little slower. So we've got, we've got two different phenomena going on. I was on right reading now. something earlier today that said that bidding wars are back, particularly in California. Are you finding that to be the case? Unbelievable. I was at an open house the other day. There must have been 300 people through. I mean, when you're a buyer looking at a house like that, you must feel like there's very little chance you're going to be getting that house. All right, let's take us uh, through a couple of properties here, Jeff. Uh, first one, okay. a very nice looking condo on Carmel Creek Road listed for $459. Uh, it's sold right. recently. I guess it's under contract for $470. Tell me about it and show us some pictures. Yeah, that one's closed, as a matter of fact, and it is a beautiful two-bedroom townhome in Carmel Valley. This is a good school district here in San Diego, and uh, the property went on the market and was immediately overbid. We actually had a single open house and uh, had 15 offers and went with an all-cash buyer uh, well over the asking price. You and had that 15 property has offers, my goodness gracious. In, so, in one day. So for, In one day. 15 yeah, offers it's, it's, in one day. All right, let's step it up yeah. a little bit to a 699 uh, five-bedroom home on Villa La Leñas. I guess I'm pronouncing that probably hammer, hammering it, but, uh, but uh, tell me about that one. Yeah, that, that listing, my spouse, my former spouse and a current coworker, Anne-Marie Shearing, uh, put that house on the market, and that house was on the market for one day also, even though the listing time says seven days, there was actually a single open house, again, hundreds of people. And it was even, there was a YouTube, YouTube video put up about how hectic and chaotic that property was. So uh, we've spread now from the under 500 hot zone to the uh, under that conforming loan limit of 697, 500 hot zone. So is that one under contract or sold or what? That, w that one is under contract for well over the asking price. Well over six ninety nine, dollars and look at the taxes there, just $8,700 uh, on a $700,000 yeah. house. For, for a guy in, uh, in uh, northern New Jersey, that looks like a bargain. All right, let's go up to well, the uh, top of the, uh, of the market here. $1.95 a beautiful ranch in Rancho Serena. Rancho Serena in Rancho Santa Fe. Christy Smith uh, listed this is the listing agent with this property, and it is a really amazing home. What we're seeing is the longer market times with these luxury homes. I mean, some of these homes used to be selling in Rancho Santa Fe five, ten, into the teens of millions, and now they are they've come down substantially. And you know, buyers, uh, the the upper end buyers are the last ones to come out of the closet after this long uh, recession that we have gotten through. But that tells you just what you said earlier at the lower end or the mid price land that's got a tennis court riding stables i'm told uh and obviously right. an in-ground pool look at the, isn't that gorgeous oh my goodness and that's a really you know, that's a really good deal for that home you know jeff it's it, i got up this morning it was 28 degrees and I, I, i'm just i'm so jealous at any rate but what you said is really true at the lower at levels you're having these bidding wars some of the very higher ends i guess are taking a little longer to come back uh and well, uh, that's why that one's on the market a little longer Right. Well, different places around the country, a million dollars is not the low end, but here in San Diego, well, yeah. it is considered the low end. So uh, people will shake their heads, but nonetheless, that's the state of the economy right here in San Diego. We've got a really booming uh, economy um, between the Qualcomm engineers who continue to just pour into the county, as, along with the other businesses that are growing. Even our commercial uh, sector, uh, we we filled 250,000 square feet of commercial right. real estate in uh, the first quarter of, of this year, right. and uh, the vacancy rate has drop below 14 percent in san diego county for the first time since 2006. jeff thank you very much for being with us continued good luck to you thank you very much Maybe